Skate parks. West Dallas, Tosa, and Oak Creek have them. Now Milwaukee is in the early stages of building its own. Fox 6's Bill Miston found out that they could get help from one of the most famous skateboarders ever. This unused lot at the corner of 5th and Rogers is owned by the city. The city plans on turning this into the city's first skate park. Tucked in the corner of Estabrook, Henry Troller, Isaac Rasmussen are spending the afternoon at the DIY skate park. The two skaters are from Bayside, but are always left wondering. Where is the skate park? This is a city, should it have a city skate park? Yeah, I talk about it all the time. Like, there's nothing here. In Milwaukee, that is. Smaller cities have skate parks. But it's well known that a skate park is much desired amenity in the city of Milwaukee. And okay, this next and part sounds dry, but so stay with me. There's a hint of change. Tucked in the agenda for a virtually held redevelopment committee meeting, it was to make changes to the tax increment financing district at First and Beecher. Money generated through that district can go towards other projects within a half mile, like painting freeway pillars, improving roads, and building a skate park. Common Council President Jose Perez is pushing the plan. It would be run through MKE Plays. And they intend to partner with Tony Hawk's organization, The Skateboard Project. The nonprofit works to create safe and inclusive skate parks for underserved communities. That said, plans are in the very early stages. We really uh, just want a place where a bunch of people can hang out. And if the city founded something like that, I mean, that'd be pretty dope. I'd be down for it. But skaters say they're ready for the plans tucked away in those city documents to become reality. <gasps> Bill Miston, Fox 6 News. You never knew Bill had those skills before, did you? The changes, they are set to go before a zoning committee next week. If approved, the plans would move on to the full Common Council.